My name is Edna Montgomery. And my name is Jasmine McCall. We are students in EDM 310 at the University of South Alabama. Today, our topic is the digital technology now coming more or less rapidly into our classrooms. If used properly, can help make our students learning real, engaging, and useful for their future. This is coming from Teaching Digital Natives by Mark Prinsky. Today, we will answer the question, do you agree or disagree with this assessment of technology? Our answer is yes, we agree. We agree with this assessment of technology because students today are surrounded by technology in their everyday lives. It is only natural that we use technology in their learning environments. Technology enables students to connect the subjects they are learning to the real world. It gives what they are learning a sense of purpose because they are able to take that knowledge and apply it to real world situations. What evidence does Prince give in teaching digital natives to support his conclusion? Prinsky states that today's students want their educations to be real. Real means that there is a perceived connection by the students at every moment or at least as often as possible between what they are learning and their ability to use that learning to do something useful in the world. When students are able to use Facebook or Twitter or post to blogs, they are able to experience immediate connections every day and they're able to share their work with worldwide audiences. What examples of proper use of technology can you provide? Two technology tools that students can use in the classroom would be Skype and Google Hangouts. They can use these two tools to host video conferences with other classrooms or professionals around the world. When students partake in these video conferences, they participate in something known as global learning. They're able to experience other cultures, form friendships, and may even learn to speak a native language. The Visual Teaching Alliance states that 70% of the population are visual learners. Discovery Ed and YouTube are two tools that teachers and students can use to add visuals to related texts. When visuals accompany the text, the student's learning comes to life. This can almost ensure engagement from all students. Whether you are ready or not, technology is definitely needed in today's classrooms. Technology is rapidly changing the way we learn, the way we think, and the way in which we communicate. When our students use technology in the classrooms, they are preparing themselves for the future that technology will create. Thank you for joining us in our discussion. Our sources are Teaching Digital Native by Mark Prinsky and Secure Edge Network. Thank you.